Guys, come online. Yes, my love. Can we play a god? What's up, y'all? Shut the up, Kane. You just literally interrupted Azoria. Well, my bad. I didn't know she was talking. Anyway, what were you saying, Azoria? Azoria. My love. Sorry. I was, uh, texting my mom. I, uh, got to go. Sorry for the inconvenience. I'm okay. She's been acting weird this past couple of days. I'll look at you. Worried about your GF. She's not my GF and shut the up. My bad. Anyway, so. Why are you still doing this to me? Because you're still my GF. We broke up months ago. Get over yourself. You're gonna do what I'll say or I'll make your life miserable. Fine. Now add me to that little GC of yours and say I'm your BF. But. Now. Okay. Oh, you're back. Yay, and can I add someone? OFC, my love. Looking for, Kira has added, who is dot me one dot to the chat. Enzo. Yay, so guys, this is my BF. Enzo proof chat me right now. Uh, why do you want to talk to my BF? Shut up and let me talk to him. Oh, okay. Enzo, what the actual f do you think you're doing? Because you are not ruining her life. Like you did to mine if that's what you think. Well, that's already happened. I've already used her for Robux and everything. And now I'll just make everyone hate you. Goodbye, Jade. I swear to God, if he ruins her life, I'm gonna kill him. Why would he even do this in the first place? The stuff he did to me. I don't want the same to happen to Azoria. I love her, but I don't know how to express my feelings. And if I do it round him, he can hurt her. And I don't want that for her. There's no telling what he is telling the GC right now. I better get back, because I know what he's capable of. And calling me names and stuff. How dare you show your face here? After what you did, that actually hurt my feelings. Yay yeah, Jade, that wasn't very nissy off what you did. What the hell did I do? Really Jade? Don't try to play innocent. He told us everything. I didn't even do shit. You know what? I'll just kick you. For what? He told us that you used him for Robux at one point of time. WTH has the one that used me and has gonna use all of you all. So, and he does don't come running back to me. Don't you believe me Azoria? No. I am um, don't. What the actual f right now? Kick me, I genuinely don't even care. Y'all are some fake f***ers. Imkane he he has kicked hiding from Azaria. Can y'all please stop? Y'all made her hate me. No, we're good. I'm leaving. Looking for, Jade has left the call. I hate them so much. I need to talk to Jade. Jade, 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 please answer. What do you want? I'm sorry, okay? There? Forcing me to agree with them. There isn't in just Enzo doing it. No, um, Kane is kind of in on it too. Emma beat his ass. No, Jade. I have a plan anyway. But how do you know about Enzo? It's kind of a long story, so I may kind of summarize it. Okay, that's all right. So we used to date a while back because we both loved each other. But I could tell he was cheating and I was gonna tell my old GC but he didn't want me to because he knew you wouldn't have friends. So he slowly started to control me, and if I didn't listen to him, he would spread rumors about me. And one day I got tired of him, so I didn't listen, and I regretted it badly. He told my whole GC lies, and everyone believed him. But they barely even knew him. So they ditched me and Enzo used them for Robux, and they realized Wave really was like, and they wanted me to forgive them, but I didn't say yay. That's how I know him. But anyway, what's your plan again? Tells her the plan. Okay, you ready? I am. Alright, add me to the GC. Sure indeed. Guys, I'm back. And I'm sorry, Enzo. But I think I'm in love with you again. Will you be my BF again? OFC, my baby. Dude, what the hell? You weren't actually supposed to love her. You were supposed to use her for Robux. F you, bro, you're a two-faced little In leaving, I hope you're at in hell. Bye. Bye. Yes, honey. Can I get maybe about 100,000 Robux? But that's just about all of mine. You don't love me then, do you? No, I do. Here you go, my love. Looking for Jade has added hiding from Azaria to the chat. Missed me? Oh, BTW, this was a plan. I know what happened. And she actually does not want to date you. 
What? So you used me for my Robux? Our Robux actually, but goodbye, hope I never see you again. Ha ha ha, he sounded so shocked. I know right lol. Jade. Yes Azoria. I have a lot to say but, Jade, I really really like you we've been friends since. We were kids so I understand if you wanna stay like that it's your opinion. But I love you you're beautiful funny sweet kind nice. And you have a great personality. Jade will you be my girlfriend? Yes I love you Azoria. Really? Yes. What should I do for today? Huh? What's with all the spamming? Go to bed, little boy. It's past your bedtime. Says the girl who goes to bed at 9 p.m. Talk about being a child here. Shut up. What the hell are you two arguing about? I was trying to sleep, you know? Why are you people spamming around this time? It's not everyday spamming at 3 a.m. So what are you people arguing about? Noah won't change his avatar. We look like a matching couple. I told you to change your avatar first, but you want to be stubborn about this. It's not that hard to change it. Hold on a minute. I woke up just to hear you two arguing about pixels. What the hell are you two? Ten-year-olds? Just go to sleep, both of you. We will discuss this nonsense. In the morning. Fine. In the morning. Looks like I'm up first. What should I do now? I could prank the GC. But how? I could pretend I'm going on holiday and be someone else. Let's see if the GC is online. Where is Tony? I'm here. Good now that everyone is here. We need to sort out why you two were arguing last night. I just didn't want him matching with my avatar. You do realize I made this outfit before you decided to make a girl version of it. So? You should know I change my avatar very often, unlike you. Are you looking for a fight, little girl? I see what's going on now. It's obvious you guys are flirting with each other. What? We are not flirting. We are simply arguing. Are you sure that's the reason? Alex, shut up. We're not flirting. Anyways, I wanted to make an announcement. Is it to finally ask Noah out? Shut up, Bella. It's not that. You should ask Alex out. Shut up. What is your announcement? So I wanted to say I'm going on holiday. So? What do you mean? A so? Well, to be honest, we don't care if you go. We know you will come back. That's true, but still you will all miss me. Of course we will. Please don't go for too long. I don't want to be stuck here with these weirdos. I won't. I will be gone for a month. A month? Guys, let's start praying so she can come back early. As for me, you can go for however long I don't really care. Just come back when you feel like it. Thanks. Anyways, bye everyone. Finally, she's gone. I know that was something. She was quite annoying, wouldn't you agree? Positive. Um, I'm just going to go... What the heck was that? They suddenly just dislike Tony. Maybe I'm overthinking this. I will go to sleep and think about this another time. With Tony. Step one is done. Time to make a new account. All done. Let me change this avatar. Now that's done. Let's see if I can friend the GC. Hopefully they aren't toxic friends that I see all over TikTok. Uno, and I win again. Okay, now you're just cheating. Don't get upset that you couldn't win against me. Shut up, hacker. One more round of Uno. Oh, hello? Hi. Do you guys mind if I can be your friends? It's weird you came up to us. And nobody else. Oh shoot, I forgot I'm being too specific. Oh, I just thought you looked cool, so I wanted to see how you two act. That's fair, I guess. I will add you two. The GC. In the GC. Alright. Now it's time for our introductions. I'm Noah. And I'm Alex. I'm Kitty. Good. Let's play doors. I want to get up to 100. I wanted to sleep. Of course you do, you sleepy pig. Shut up. You look like a ghost. Are you sure you're not Casper the Friendly Ghost? Are you sure you're not my grandpa? Damn. I'm just going to go. Well done, Noah. You scared her off with your grandpa voice. Oh, shut up and go play your horror game. I need some sleep. With Bella. I feel so much better after that rest. But something is off. I will just investigate this. Oh, it's you. What are you doing up so late? I could ask you the same question. I just wanted to be online. Are you sure that's your only reason? Oh, so you think I'm hiding something? No, I just find you suspicious for staying up late. Normally, you would go sleep. Are you waiting for someone? No. Alex, tell me the truth. Bella, just stop. I'm not hiding anything. 
Fine. I will leave you alone for now. Finally. I should be more careful next time. I don't want her to find out. Not yet. With Tony. Well, now I know what my friends do while I'm away. Everything seems pretty normal so far. So I don't need to overthink what my friends might be doing if they do this nearly every day. It's getting late and I have school tomorrow. If only school had shorter days. In the morning. Guys, I just want to say I will miss you all when I'm in school. Calm down. We're not at a funeral. Just trying to share my appreciation here. Hey guys. Wait, who is this? I'm Kitty. I'm new to the GC. Nice to meet you. I'm Bella. Sorry, but I have to go. I have school. Okay, you two need to start talking right now. Why are you upset with us, Bella? Because Tony went to her holiday like a few days ago, and you two decided to have a new member in the GC. It's like you two are trying to replace Tony. So I want answers right now. What are you two really up to? Should we really tell her Noah? Well, we should since she caught us red-handed. Go on. I'm waiting for you two to explain. Bella, Tony is just not for us. She's so dramatic with everything. She's also a pick-me, not going to lie. So you two hate Tony? Yes. I'm not believing that Tony is annoying or dramatic. That might just be her personality that we shouldn't judge. You're right, but still, the fact remains that we dislike Tony. What are you three talking about? We're talking about Tony. You all dislike her personality, which I won't accept. Sure, Tony can be little over the top, but that doesn't mean you should dislike her. Maybe she's acting that way so we don't leave her. We spent years together, but it shouldn't end because of Tony. Bella, I know you want to support Tony in this, but this won't change our mind about her. I'm sorry, but I'm dropping Tony. Same. Same here. So you're all just going to leave Tony just like that? I can't believe I was friends with all of you. You all should be ashamed of yourselves. And I'm going to tell Tony about this when she comes back. I think we should apologize. Well, Bella is right. We can't just judge Tony for her actions. Alex, since when did you swap sides? Yeah, just after Bella left. You just switched sides. I understand what Bella is trying to say about Tony. Maybe we shouldn't actually judge Tony. Alex, what are you saying? I decided I'm not leaving Tony. And as Bella said, we should be ashamed. I don't want to be part of this anymore. I'm going to leave you two. I hope you two will come to your senses and apologize to Bella and Tony. Why is our plan suddenly backfiring on us? We planned this out perfectly. It's because of Bella that we lost Alex. We need to get rid of Bella. She's getting in the way of our plan. All we can do is try since Bella is now our main target. Whatever you do, don't be too obvious. The last thing I want is that the plan would be screwed up if we're not careful. Bella is vigilant in these types of things. Reason why we should be careful. Let's think of a plan for Bella. With Bella and Alex. I can't believe those guys. After all those years, they just want to leave Tony. How could they be so rude? Bella. What do you want? I came to apologize. So you finally realize what you said about Tony. Well, half of what I said was true about her. I'm expecting the apology. I'm sorry for what I said about Tony. You were right. Those three favorite words. I was right. Whatever. Rub it in as much as you want. As much as I love to right now. We need a plan for Noah and Michael. Are you sure about this? This can take a long while to plan out. To be honest, all of this drama makes me sick. Honestly, I think we should leave this. Fighting fire with fire won't do anything. You're right. Is there seriously nothing for us to do about it? No, Bella. Sorry. Some people just go and try find someone better. Whatever choice they made... We can't change that or force them to stay. You just have to let them go. Well, I can't argue with that fact. Can we at least tell Tony about this? The last thing I want is her going upset and feeling lonely. What if she doesn't believe you? She will. I know she will believe me. If you insist. With Tony. School was boring. Let's see what the GC is up to. I'm so bored. Then learn how to be unbored. Hey, guys. What are you two up to? Nothing much, just thinking about something. Something? It's nothing. They're acting strange. Oh, okay. This is a GC meeting. Since when? Since now? We're here to talk about Tony. Seriously? You still haven't dropped that yet. Tony? Tony is a girl who went on holiday. What? Kitty, you seem upset about Tony. So I've been lied to all this time. What do you mean? I'm Tony. Wait, what? I lied about going on holiday. 
I wanted to see if you all were loyal or not. Only Bella and Alex has passed that test. I'm going to kick both of you out. And Noah, I actually did have a crush on you, but that doesn't matter anymore. Tony I heart cats has kicked. Michael I love Ed. Tony, please let me explain. I don't want to hear it. And if you want to apologize, I won't accept it. Tony I heart cats kicked Noah RPG. I'm very sorry, Tony. It's all right. I'm glad I did that test. Now let's go play something. I don't want to dim down the mood. Tony, Bella and Alex grew a stronger friendship, and they all never met their ex-friends again. Rat, I have some important news. What are the news? Rat, you forgot to say queen. Oh, sorry, queen. Uh, anyways, I've been seeing this guy. And you're meeting him today? He will move in here. Okay, queen, does he have any kids? Yes, he has one boy, he's seven. Okay, queen. Rat, go upstairs. Okay, queen. Owned a seven-year-old. I hope he's not too annoying. But yes, finally a dad who's nicer than mom. Rat, come downstairs, he's here. I'm coming, queen. Hi. Hello. Hey, babe. Hi, darling. Hi. Wow, I'm so happy to have such a hot daughter. Oh, um, thanks. Babe, don't you think I'm prettier than her? I mean, come on, look at her. No, I mean, yeah, of course you're pretty, Ermel. So what are your names? Marcus. Leo. I'm Addison, but you can call me ADI. I'm Anna. Leo, do you want to go to my room? Yeses. No, Rat, I mean ADI. Don't you want to stay here a little? Please, Queen. Please, ma'am, I want to go upstairs. Did you just talk back? I mean, uh, you don't need to call me ma'am. You can call me queen instead of ma'am. A darling, why can't he call you mom? Because he isn't my son. Queen, can we please go upstairs? A uh, fine, but dinner will be ready soon. Okay, queen. Hi, Leo. Hi, why do we have to call your mom queen? So a promise not to tell anyone, but my mom is actually a criminal. She thinks I don't know it and she gets very mad easily. Can I tell you something about my dad? Of course. So my dad gets interested in teenage girls, so just be careful. Oh, I will. Thanks for telling me. Yeah. Dinner's ready. We're coming. Took you rats long enough. Sorry, queen. So we only made to so we have to share. Yuck, I mean yummy. You better be happy that you get food. Here, darling. Here, Addison. Thanks. Oh, you look so hot when you eat. Ah, uh, thanks, IG. Was it good, Rat? Um, hum. How about you, my love? It was good. That's great, I made it with love. Thanks for the food, Mo, I mean queen. Yeah, thanks, queen. Okay, go upstairs. I don't want to see your ugly faces, haha, -ha, joking. Was it a joke? No. Bye, queen. Bye, rats. Bye, hottie. That food was so disgusting. Okay, well, you'll have to get used to it. But is there no way we can escape? I don't want to live with the criminal. I don't know, Leo. I've never tried escaping. Look, I'm very tired, but we can plan it tomorrow. Okay, but I'm scared of your mom. Leo, you don't need to be scared. I know she's harsh sometimes and calls us rats, but that's it. Okay, but good night. Good night. Good morning, Leo. Boom. Rude anyways, let's go downstairs. Okay. Boy, did you become rude overnight or what? Let me explain. So I kind of told mom that you knew she was a criminal and I told dad that you hated him. Uh. You did W-H-A-D. Look, mom loves me now and hates you. Oh, you stupid MF boy. I hate you. SM, you came in my life and ruined IT. Haha, <laughs> I never liked you. You gave me bad vibes. Dude, I thought I could trust you. Well, you're wrong. Ugh. Oh, uh, there that stupid bitch is. Yeah, she's so stupid. Guys, it's not W-H-A-P-I-T looks like. Why would I be a criminal? Because I heard you on the phone calling someone and telling them we can't let anyone know about this. That doesn't mean I am a criminal. Look, Mom, I'm sorry. I mean, Queen. Hi, Mommy and Daddy. Hello, sweetie. And why did you say you hated me? I didn't. That's a straight up lie. No, it's not. Wanna know something Leo said? Yes. He said you know my dad he gets interested in teenage girls, 
so be careful. That's not true, Leo. Why did you say that? I didn't. She's lying. You did and we both know IT. Look, Leo, I believe you. You're my son. You would never say that about me. I also believe you, Leo. I love you, mom and dad. We love you too. You know we'd have had enough of this. By you stupid <laughs> You're gonna miss me when I'm gone. I'm running away, stupid <laughs> No, what are you doing? Ha, huh, bye. We won't miss you. Wow, it's very cold. But I'm obviously not gonna go back to them. I think I'm gonna start a fire. Way better. I can't believe Leo I thought he was my friend. Hi. Uh, hi, who are you? I'm Alex. I saw you go into Two Woods and my parents told me to go to you and tell you that you can stay at our house. Oh, um, yes, please. Are you sure? Oh, FC. I'm Addison. We kinda look alike. Iker. Well, how old are you? Fifteen, you. Same, haha. Oh, haha. -ha. Anyways, it's pretty cold out here, so follow me and I'll show you the way to my house. Okay. Here we are. Hi, welcome to our house. Hi, and thank you so much. Of course. Haha, -ha, I just noticed you and Alex look pretty much alike. Oh yeah, that's exactly what we said. We're also the same age. Oh really, so you're 15? Yes. Dad, you haven't said hi to Addison yet. Oh hi Addison, nice to meet you. My name is Noah. Nice to meet you too. So why were you in the woods? Don't you have a family? Guys, can I tell you something? Of, of course. course. So yeah, that's what happened. Oh, that's not good. Well, I'm very sorry that happened to you. It's okay, I'm happy I'm here with you guys now, though. Yay. Do you guys mind if I get some food? I haven't eaten today. Of course, honey, grab whatever you want. I have to talk to Alex a little bit. Okay, thank you so much. You, come with me, Alex. Okay. So I've been needing to tell you something for a while. What is it? So you eat jam. When you were born, you actually had a twin sister. W-H-A-T? Let me explain. So when we went home from the hospital, it was very late at night and I was exhausted. So I fell asleep very quick. I had you and your sister sleeping with me, but suddenly I heard glass breaking. So I ran as fast I could to Noah, and he also heard it. I was so stupid because I let you and your sister alone in the bedroom. Then, we waited in his bedroom about 30 minutes. Then I slowly opened the door and went to my bedroom and only saw you there, not your sister. Why didn't you tell me this earlier? I didn't think it's the right time, but I honestly think Anison is your twin sister. Oh. There's one in way to know if she's your twin. When she was a baby, she had a birthmark behind her E. We need to tell her now. Okay, okay. Addison, please come here. Hi. Hi. We need to tell you something. Yeah. Alex, do you want to tell her? Yeses. Tell me. So what this might seem weird, but I think we're twins. W-H-A-D. No, we can't be. I have a family and everything. There's only one way finding out. Can I look behind you, E? I know it's weird, but when you were a baby, you had a birthmark behind you, E. I guess. Oh yes you do. Onk you're my daughter. OMG WHAD. I can't believe this. Wait so my parents kidnapped me? I guess. But Onk I can't believe this. Can we have a group hug? Of, of course. course. But guys we have to report your mom to the police. You're right. I have a plan I'll go to her house and tell her that I have to show her something and then she will jump in the car and you will drive to the police. Okay, let's hope that works. Yeah, we can do this. Okay, guys, let's go hop in the car and follow me. Okay, stay in the car, I'll go inside. She knocks. And uh, not you again. Mom, I'm so sorry. I have a present for you in the red car. Uh, okay. Follow me. How do I know I can trust you? Queen, I'm your daughter. Like you said, you're not a criminal. It's a gift to say sorry for everything. Fine. Follow me. Okay, hop in. Okay, rat. Where are we going? It's a surprise. Okay, we're here. Just keep your eyes closed. We will go inside first and talk a little bit with the people in the building. 
Okay, I guess. Hello, we would love to report a case of kidnapping. My daughter got kidnapped when she was newborn. Okay, miss. Do you know who the kidnapper is? Yes, we do. She's sitting in the red car outside. Okay, miss. I will go and arrest her. Just wait here. Okay. Open the door. Police is here. What? Why are we at the police station? Don't act so confused. We know you kidnapped the child. What? No, I didn't. Come with me. Let's go inside the police station. Okay. Hey guys, is this the kidnapper? Yes. yes. Okay, what proof do you have? So when Addison was a baby, she has a birthmark behind her E. And she does now too. And that night when I came home from the hospital, I fell asleep and has the babies with me then suddenly I heard glass breaking and when I went back only Alex was there not Addison. Oh uh, okay fine I did it. You're under arrest for 80 years. W-H-A-T, that's such a long time. Come with me miss. Oh yes, finally she got arrested. Yeah. yeah. Let's buy a lottery ticket to celebrate. Yes, that's a great idea. There are tickets outside. Okay, let's go buy one. Yeah. Selling lottery tickets. We would like to buy one, but how old are you, sweetheart? Seven. Wait, do you know someone whose name is Leo? Yes. One boy in my class has the name Leo and he is the bully. Oh, I understand you. He was very mean to me too. Yeah. Okay, but back to the lottery ticket. We would like to buy one. Okay, that would be two dollars. Okay, I'm just gonna check my bag. Oh shoot, I forgot my wallet. I'll go home and get it really quickly, so you guys just stay here. Okay. What's your name? I'm Mia. What's your name? Addison. Alex. Hey guys, I'm back. Mom, that didn't even take you a minute. I told you I was fast, but here you have $2. Thank you, here's your ticket. Thanks. Noah, Noah. Yay, darling. OMG, so Addison is my daughter. Yes. Um, can I call you guys mom and dad? Of course. We, we love, love you, you Addison. Addison. What about Alex? Oh, we love him too. Yeah. Okay, good. But guys, let's scratch the lottery ticket. Yes. Okay, a one, a four, a eight, a six, a two, and a five. Okay, turn on the TV, and let's see if we won. Hi, everyone. So today, we will be announcing the winning numbers for the lottery tickets. The first number is a 1, then a 4, 8, a 6, a 2, and a 5. Ong, I think we won. Ong, yeah, we did. OMG, we're rich. Yes, how much money do we get? One million dollars, I think. Okay, guys, let's not scream. The car is a little bit broken, so we have to find something to prepare it. Uh, but it wasn't broken when we came here. Anyways, follow me to the basement. Noah, you can stay here. Uh, okay. Okay, guys, find something to prepare the car. Uh, I mean, there are some tools in the cage, but I don't want to go in there. Why not? My back hurts, and I've raised you for 15 years, Alex. You know what? You both can go inside the cage and get it. Alex, let's just go inside and get it so Mom doesn't get mad. Good girl, Addison. Fine. W-H-A-T are you doing? Haha, <laughs> you're so stupid. What? Me and Addison's kidnapper were really good friends. W-H-A-T. So you're not our real mom? Of course not. Anna and I decided to take one baby. I wanted the boy, so she took the girl. And Noah. Yeah, I'm cheating on him with the hottest boy ever. But Noah isn't as innocent as you think. He agreed to kidnap you, Alex. So who are our real parents? Hi, you really think I would tell you that? Please, we're begging you. I can tell you one thing she did to me. She stole my boyfriend as a kid. Ha huh, that day, I told her she would regret that. Anyways, I'm gonna go and help Anna escape jail.
Wow, I can't believe this. Ugh, it's all your fault. You said we should go in here. Don't blame it on me. Ugh. Okay, first I need to go and collect the money and then help Anna.